Hi, welcome back to Rebecca's Travels or if you're watching my lifestyle channel, uh, welcome back to uh, Rebecca's Lifestyle. Um, it's a nice day um, in the UK today, it's nice and sunny um, and um, I'll just show you the sky. Um, so yes, um, I would just say it's warm today, it's not overly hot um, here in the Midlands but it's uh, still nice um, you don't need to wear a coat or anything like that um, today I'm going to be doing a review um, on Oban where I visited in Scotland um, but before we jump right into it could you please subscribe to my channel um, it's free to subscribe and I upload uh, five times a week and I love talking about travel and uh, lifestyle so um, I'm going to jump right into it in my Oban review um, again I really enjoyed um, on the eastern pier and um, the fish at uh, fish and chip restaurant uh, that i uh, went in and um, it was uh, quite expensive at about 15 pounds but um i did get uh, quite a lot fish chips and um, a salad and some sauces etc so um and you could also have salt and pepper but um i don't put salt on my food anyway um but um yes there's a range of other options that you can choose as well um in regards to seafood and um also i really enjoyed the witherspoons that um i went in um on the other pier like the the western pier um and um it also had like another restaurant and a uh, shop uh, where i brought some souvenirs and i'll do my souvenir video next week um on what i've brought um in scotland um but uh, yes um the, the shops um or at least on the seafront was uh, mostly full up and uh, pubs etc um, again it looks like a wide range to choose from as well which is really good um, we had two hours in Oban but I would have liked uh, more time uh, to um, explore uh, the Roman amphitheater at the top there but i would like to go there next time and do a couple of say museums um and uh, visit the side streets if i went again and um, at Hoban you can also get uh, boats uh, to say uh, different islands uh, a variety of islands and so that's uh, really good uh, different trip options and um, also there's um a train station as well um in oban and um also there's taxis and um buses so again a lot of tra transport options and um, in and around um oban um and uh, by the looks of things there's uh, some parks as well and um seats to sit on and um to uh, toilets um around the place as well um so um yes it was um in my opinion a very pretty uh, town to go and visit and i would love to go there again and uh, spend um some more time there um so um yes um i would uh, definitely love to go there again and um 
again sp spend some more time in Oban. Um, again, uh, there's lots of clothing shops, cafes, um, restaurants, bars, um, and there's probably some uh, nightclubs as well or bars to choose from. So a range of options there. Also, there's um, a range of accommodation such as, say, um, hotels uh, to choose from uh, um, or like um, guest houses, uh, B&Bs, um, Hugh Fostels as well. Um, so, yes. Um, but I would definitely recommend if you haven't uh, visited Oban to uh, visit Oban. And um, I would like to say thank you for watching uh, my channel and enjoy your day. And um, I'm going to do a, another review, um, which is going to be on Friday. And it's going to be a review on Dunhoon, where I stayed. So thank you for watching and bye for now. Thank you. Bye.